Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Uh, very, very excited. It is a Christmas in July, that is for sure. Uh, I am so, so happy to be guest contributing for Rosie Studios this month with their newly released collection, Sprinkled With Cheer. Uh, you can see already this is like totally up my street so I am so excited. Today I am going to do a quick little flip through of the collection with you uh, and then you can expect to see some projects using this. Well I was going to say throughout the month but throughout the year. So let's just get started. I'm going to start with um, some stickers. I, there are a lot of things in this collection so let's start with the stickers. First up we have puffy stickers. These are just kind of a general collection of motifs from the collection uh, and you can see why I love it so much. Pink, red, green, teal, all of these cute little characters. It is just so so cute. I love 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 these tangled lights puffy stickers. That's one big long puffy sticker. So cute. The other thing that I love about um, this collection is the puffy stickers are all really small. I love me a tiny puffy sticker and speaking of puffy stickers that are super small and super cute, check out all of these peppermint candy stickers. Uh, I'm, I'm like really really gonna have to resist the urge to hoard with these ones um, otherwise we have a range of colored bows and some little snowflakes on this puffy sticker sheet so cute I'm definitely gonna need like I don't know what 10 sheets of this uh, skipping on to a chipboard and again I love the Rosie Studio chipboard because it is super thin it's really hard for you to see but it is super thin chipboard and they're really like nicely sized for putting together uh, December daily projects, 3x4 cards, 4x6 cards, traveler's notebooks, this sort of thing. Lovely, lovely small little chipboards. And again, we got my favorite little peppermint candies as well as some gingies and a gingerbread house. I love them and I love this pink on pink combo, obviously. Uh, as well as stickers, so I've got some more stickers, but um, there's also this uh, clear stamp set where we've got all of these little gingies again, so totally cute for making your cards this year. Um, so many cute, cute little Christmas sayings. I love this. Christmas wishes and gingerbread kisses. I mean, it might be my theme for the year, really. I love it that much. So cute. Uh, and then back to the stickers. More puffy stickers. Uh, this time, they're kind of like titles, which I really love. This kind of whimsical mix of sort of uppercase and scripty fonts. There's also a bunch of little snowflakes um, chucked in there as well. But again, all my favorite colors, red, pink, teal, and green. Uh, last up with the puffy stickers, we've got some alphas. Uh, no numerals on this set, but tons and tons of tiny little puffy sticker letters. I love them. Again, appropriately sized for an album. Um, and then also some little puffy sticker tiny words down the bottom here. All my favorite. Uh, feeling merry and bright. So cute. And my favorite. Oh, happy, oh, <laughs> jolly, happy, merry, merry everything. All of the pink stickers. I just love, love, love them. And last up with the stickers is this cardstock sticker pack. So there are four sheets of stickers in here. Very generous. Uh, I'll show you on the back here the kinds of stickers that we've got. Two different sheets of little icon stickers. I love all of these tiny small ones. Actually, let me pull these out of the packet for you. That's better. Now we can see what we're working with because some of these stickers uh, gold foiled, so beautiful. I love this wee Santa. He's so cute. So these ones are like a little bit larger and then a whole bunch of teeny tiny little icons, which I just love. I love this wee pink point setter. So cute. Some more little peppermint candies in here too. These ones are, can you see, they're, they're gold foiled as well. And then a bunch of labels and tiny word stickers. Some of them are also foiled. I love these label stickers. They are so fun. I use labels a lot. And last up, oh, these little stamp ones. They are 
foiled as well. All sorts of different shapes on here, lots of banners and a few kind of, um, they look like planner stickers to me which might be fun to use as well. So that's all of the stickers in the collection. Let's look at embellishments. Uh, first up, these chipboard frames. Uh, let me open them. So very cute, and as you can see, gold foiled as well. So this is more kind of like an Instax size, and then there are little square ones, which will be perfect for Instagram pics. And again, the chipboard's not like super duper thick, so, uh, easy to put into an album without that album like bulking out over the month. So lots of little square ones in all of the collection colors. There is another kind of Instax size one in pink. That's my favorite. Uh, and then three little ovals again with the gold foil and one larger rectangle one. So those are all of the little chipboard frames. Now I am um, super stupidly excited about these journal cards. I'm going to open them up to show you, but the first thing you'll notice, square corners. <laughs> Rosie Studio cards are normally rounded. Um, I love a square corner on my Project Life or journal cards, so I am super excited about these. I'm going to show you them. This is again another kind of product that I'm going to want like at least another pack of because uh, there are two of each in each in the pack but they're both double sided so I'm just going to show you each one. So we've got pink 25 December, this really cute wish list, an undated calendar which this is perfect if you run your December daily like before December. Often I've got like a few kind of Christmassy events in November that I would want to use and so it's really handy to have this undated because I can kind of start the month wherever I need it to be. Now these are really fun kind of like little book library cards. There's a whole bunch of these in here just a kind of general ledger but it's really hard for you to see but it's pink and red, pink red lines. So cute. There's another journal card, sorry, library card, and then just a little grid card as well. Another, this one's kind of in grey with all of the coloured stripes, and then a teal grid. This is another kind of like, uh, like ledger kind of paper in a green on green. Property of Santa, I totally love that, so cute. Uh, another pink library card. So the other thing with these cards is they're like not super duper Christmas themed. So if you've got some left over or you want to start using them right now, you totally can. Another ledger paper library card. More ledger paper. Do you see what I mean? Like they're so generalized, but they're in the colors that I love. Do not open until December 25. We've got some red on pink library, uh, not library, red on pink music notes. Peaking not permitted. Another kind of ledger paper. Property of Santa, this time in red. Another undated calendar in pink. Mwah. Green on green music notes. Just regular notes and making a list. So, so many cards and I don't believe that they're all just like December themed. This is totally, totally versatile pack. So, next up, sprinkles. I don't know if you can get in there. There's peppermint candies, there's stars, there's tiny little pink bows, there's like candy cane sprinkles. Just such a such a cute little mix of sprinkles to either use on their own or maybe like break it up with some extra sequins. You know I like my December projects extra sparkly. Um, so easy to do with this pre-made mix. And then I have got the last of the embellishments is two different uh, ephemera die cut packs. So one is sentiments and one is ephemera. There are like 
literally hundreds of die cuts in here so I'm not going to show you each and every one uh, they contain 174 pieces in this pack so uh, there's always two of each so you don't have to worry about hoarding your favorites as you can see little peppermint candies there are gold foils in here we've got gingy again lots of stamps are uh, gingy in a hot chocolate super cute so many fun designs. I know when I first saw this collection, I like squealed with joy because so, so cute. And this one is the sentiment pack. So there's 140 pieces in here. And again, two of each design. So no worrying about using up your favorites. There are some sort of three by four kind of journaly cards, lots of tags, lots of tickets, lots of tiny words. So cute. This is a really useful pack. Like if you're not kind of uh, mega into like the cutesy kind of look, then this is a simple, super kind of like versatile pack if you want to be a little bit more, I mean, I'm loath to say it, but like grown up. December's not the time to be grown up, but if you want to, <laughs> this, this is a really good pack for you. Now I'm going to show you the papers in the 12, uh, in the, sorry, the 6x6 paper pad. I do have the 12x12 papers here, but I gotta say, uh, when this collection arrived at my doorstep, I like, like I said, squealed with joy and then immediately started ripping things open. So, here's a little sneaky peek of something that's coming later in the week, but I have already cut up some of the papers. So I can't show you all of the 12 by 12s. Needless to say, all of the patterns are there. I'm gonna go with the six by six paper pad. The papers in the paper pad are just that, they are paper. The uh, papers in the 12 by 12s, they're a little bit thicker. So this is 180 GSM and they are single-sided papers. So you don't have to worry about using up all of your kind of favorite B sides. Um, one of each in the 12 by 12 pack. Uh, and in this paper pad, you get two of each sheet. So heaps to use. Again, these are single-sided, so you're never gonna run out. Lots of tiny gingies. This really pretty teal kind of snowflake pattern. I love this one. Sprinkles and some of these are gold foiled. There's some really, really cute ooh, and kind of matchy Christmas trees. It is not like a super in your face Christmas tree pattern though, so you could really easily get away with it just being triangles. This is so fun, a gold foiled plaid. Millions of little Santa hats. I just love the colors in this collection. The pinks and the reds are so nice. I'll even give you green because we're talking a Christmas collection. So green on green, kind of a starry grid pattern. Millions and millions of baubles <laughs> and candy canes. This stripe is so pretty too. It's got all the colors in the collection. So a really good kind of general paper. And then there are a couple of different florals in here, but this is a really pretty red and pink and green on white. Another plaid, this time we've got red, pink, and green. My favorite, good old candy cane stripe. You can't go past it, can't go wrong with it for a December themed project. And this one here, so, so cute. Joy, love, and cheer. It's a white text on that beautiful, really cool toned pink background. Mm, so good. There's another kind of floral. This time it's a little bit more holly themed. Hard to see. It is a pink background this time instead of white. And then we've got that same kind of starry grid pattern, this time with pink and red. All my favorite little peppermint candies again. And there is that super fun tangled up. I mean, it could be lights. These ones look more like a kind of garland and you can see this one is um, gold foiled as well. Another plaid, red, pink and green. And a much more subtle plaid. So this is green on green. And that is all of the papers. So like I said, there are two in the pack. So all of those times two. 
So that is the Sprinkled with Cheer collection. I will be back later in the week to share my first project using this collection. You can imagine how happy I am. I really, really can't wait till December and uh, now I don't have to and neither do you. I will leave the links to the collection down below for you. Hey, thank you for joining me today, guys. I really hope that you enjoyed the video. If you did, please go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I'll see you again really soon. Bye.